There was always somebody working on this case. Um, I know some of them went a full 24 hours before even uh, closing their eyes. When we were out till three o'clock in the morning, our sheriff was out till three o'clock in the morning. Everybody put down their cases and said, you know, these can wait, we prioritize. This was a top priority. And um, again, everybody stepped up to the plate. For the first 48 hours, probably on two hands, we may be able to count the number of hours that our investigators slept. Um, that video, um, we had to watch over and over and over again. Um, it's very taxing, grueling to watch that. And the youngest boy's father, still see the pain in his eyes, but you know, hopefully it lessened it. Just the hope, you know, that hope that we gave them by those few words, you know, meant something. I can only wonder about how the suspect juvenile was in the place that he was even in. Um, I mean, that's the only way I can, I just can't fathom it. It's been a rough road. Um, we have to put on our tough faces, and um, you know we have to just keep it moving. Under unfortunate circumstances, but it brought, <clears throat> excuse me, it brought us closer to our community and brought the community closer to us. They gave to us what we needed to help them.